Minnesota is making some progress on its massive pothole problem. In Minneapolis alone, crews have used around 2,000 tons of hot mix to patch up streets throughout the day. But as WCCO's David Schumann learned, Minnesota has been working for years toward a future with fewer potholes. The imperfections in the road tell a story. One for Ben Worrell to decipher. We're looking right now on research in a lot of different areas, a way to be, be building roads in a smarter fashion. He's an engineer at the state's Minroad facility in Otsego, where solutions to pesky potholes are on the agenda. Uniformity is king. I mean, that's what you're looking for, and providing the tools for these operators of the different construction equipment really is going to go a long way in producing better roads. Cracks in the road that get water in them, water seeping up from them, that's what leads to the road weakening and eventually a pothole. What they're trying to do here is research what materials are less impacted by water. So here's one of our data collection areas. It's very simple, it's a computer, but really the brains behind this is all the great research we have here working in the facility to understand this information. Temperature, moisture levels, amount of bend in the concrete, it's all being recorded for dozens of different road materials over miles of track. Trying things on a small scale here at our facility can lead towards implementation throughout the state. Ben says better materials and consistency in construction are the keys to improving Minnesota's roads. But as long as all different kinds exist, built across many different years, saying goodbye to potholes permanently probably remains a pipe dream. Well, there's a balancing act here on how you balance your money and get the best performance for your network. In Otsego, David Schumann, WCCO News. Another focus of the state's research is on more environmentally sustainable mixtures that use less cement.